So really, we hope to come back in the second quarter of 2021 uh, to at least bring some of our bigger conventions back. You know, we have big conventions in June, which could be a good target for us. So we're hoping that the second half of 2021 will be a much brighter uh, year for us. And um, we have to work pretty hard now through April to get us ready for that June uh, new year. <laughs> we have done plenty of testing in Clark County. Um, Clark County used our CARES money and we provided testing to all residents uh, that are free. We've been working directly with our hotels and our conventioners because we want to make sure that uh, we can bring them back safely. So we anticipate that we can put together some testing that will help people when they come to our state, whether it's a test that's already been administered or they want to have one here on site. Uh, we're working hard um, now to get our community spread under control and we think after the first of the year that we'll be uh, much lower in numbers and we can start building on uh, bringing more people back into our community. The light at the end of the tunnel for many, um, our healthcare workers have been working nonstop since last January when COVID was um, first in the US. Uh, so we'll be starting out with our healthcare workers being the first folks, um, then our home health folks that work within the um, uh, senior facilities, the acute facilities, um, they'll get theirs at the same time and then we'll move on to our public safety. So we know that uh, many of them have to stay frozen in a certain temperature then there's a thawing process and then we'll administer as many as possible um, as we can. There's 164,000 statewide. There's about 170,000 first responders. So we feel comfortable that um, we'll be able to provide both um, shots to them uh, in the time frame needed and then we'll be on to our second batch.